after what had happened, I knew I could no longer stay in this place. So following the strange map I had found, I set sail. I set out to the high seas in pursuit of a new land, one that had not been tainted by the wither storm, one that hadn't been destroyed by the chaos that I caused. But little did I know that this curse would follow me to the ends of the earth. As I landed on shore, I began to look around at my surroundings. Finding this ancient structure, I decided to investigate it and take the loot that was in its chest. Haunted by what I saw and what I knew I would have to do, I began to collect the basic resources that I would need to survive. Night was approaching and I knew I would need food to survive, so I gathered it from the local wildlife before going to find the wreckage of my ship. I gathered any items of value out of my ship, but most importantly, I grabbed the map that brought me to this land. Following the map brought me through treacherous areas, but once I had reached the treasure at the end of it, I knew I had done all of the preparing that I could, and it was time. Little did I know that my own greed was going to repeat an age-old cycle of destruction. How many times I ran through this. This time, I felt weaker. I felt mortal again. Something as if, if I were to die, it would finally be the end of this vicious cycle. But I can't. I can't help myself. I must have it. I must have that star. The power it gives me. There's no time to waste. I quickly headed straight for the house where the wither storm had laid dormant for hundreds of years. Little did I know what the true destructive power would be. Would this really be worth it? Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get out of here. Alright, looks like he is just eating that entire house. Oh, nice. That's just super convenient. Oh, sweet. Let me go there first. Spider says, oh crap, oh, he's damaged. This boy's weak. Uh, I don't think this house is safe. I don't think anywhere here is safe. I already hear him blowing stuff up. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Now, the comments on my last video, they said sneaking behind a shield will make him not see me, which apparently does seem to be working.
I have a plan, boys. Oh, I was hoping there'd be a big cave down here. Ah, uh, Alright, boys, we got two minutes of water breathing. Trying to pull me. The Wither Storm's trying to pull. He may not be cute, but he pulled. He pulled me. Wither Storm W Riz. I need to just get low, and I need to get diamonds. Oh, my water breathing ran out. After collecting several diamonds, I had to travel to the only place safe from the wither storm, the nether. Check out my hearts. This is called wither sickness. The wither sickness is a storm transmitted disease. <coughs> what the wither sickness does is it slowly decreases my maximum HP until it reaches zero, but I'm in hardcore mode. So I needed to use the resources that I had gathered to craft a golden apple stew, which can be used to cure the wither sickness. <coughs> Mm. Oh, it looks like all my loot's gonna be safe. What do we got? Blast Prot 3. And just some clean diamond boots that's still good we're in 1.19 which makes this much easier but what do i want to make in the netherite all right so i'm gonna mine a thousand blocks this way so i'm gonna go to 1217 all right so we've gone 1000 blocks which is gonna be 8000 blocks in the overworld which should be honestly plenty of distance from the wither storm to Honestly, collect up some gear. The main things that I want to collect up is to get a better enchanting setup. Uh, well, these enchantments are pretty bad right now. Uh, I hope I spawn near a village because I'm just going to basically steal villager bookshelves. And basically, the first piece of prop 4 gear is going to get that netherite ingot. The moment I pop out of that portal, this wither storm is going to just make a mad dash. I don't know how fast he can fly 8,000 blocks, but basically this portal has got to be safe because I need to be able to re-enter it. Actually, I have 46 obsidian. I think I'll probably be fine to just make another portal if I have to. Of course, we made the corners. Don't even worry about it. All right, I don't know what to expect coming out of this. And subspace bubble, that's cool. Oh my gosh, this is terrible, bad. Wait, hold up. Oh! Yes! Infinite shield glitch, let's go. Okay, I don't even care. We did the infinite shield glitch by accident. I totally forgot about that. Five hours later. Uh, yes, let's go. There's no book house. Oh my goodness, I'm so angry. Oh my goodness, let's freaking go. Okay, no book house. Well, you guys are all gonna get eaten by the wither storm. Have fun. I'm gonna go find a guy with a book. One eternity later. Yes, yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I am so close. There's gotta be just one more book house. Finally. Is there a book house? I cannot tell yet. After searching for, I kid you not, six entire hours and only finding a handful of villages and only one of them actually containing the bookshelves that I needed, I decided to change my plan and just trade with villagers for enchanted books, which I actually did not want to do because I would also have to collect resources to trade for emeralds. But in the long run, this actually does save me a bunch of time Oh, dang it, he's here.
All right, so here's the plan. I'm going to move in a direction, probably this way, collecting blocks as I go, of course. And I'm basically going to lure the Wither Storm over to a different portal. So that way I can go back to my village and try and move my villagers in to the nether safely, which is going to be difficult. Uh, okay, so this should be far enough. Let me just check what it is really quickly. All right, good. He's moving this way. All right, now I need to prepare this place for my villagers. Okay, that's really all that's important. I'm gonna just sit you in the boat. Oh no, I need to start trading with you quick. I only have 26 emeralds, okay. I can't have my villagers dying on me now, can I? That's what we're gonna do. There we go. Protection four on the chest plate. Protection four on the legs. And we're gonna upgrade this chest plate to netherite. Oh, jeez. And I didn't bring any of the stuff to make my portal with. Better not be copyrighted, I swear. Now that I had obtained the command block book from killing the withered symbiote, I could finally take down the wither storm for once and for all by crafting the formida bomb. Um, all right, I need a lot more gunpowder, which means it's time to basically go up to the surface, I suppose. Luckily, I'm pretty strong now, so I should be safe from pretty much anything. Uh, 
Okay, I guess we're gonna have to just go down into the caves. Of course there'd be another symbiote, my friend. We actually have enough. Oh shoot, we actually need a couple more pieces. We need to first start by crafting by crafting a super TNT. Now we can make the forbidden bomb. Cause let's go blow this dude up. Alright. A wither wussy. Come on, where are you at? Hello, Wither Storm. Wanna see me drop an F bomb? It seemed as if it was over, as if I had defeated the Witherstorm for once and for all. But I knew this was only but a minor setback for the Witherstorm, and that this would actually cause it to achieve its full power. But if not for this, I would never be able to defeat the Witherstorm for once and for all. Knowing that the Witherstorm would soon come back to continue its reign of havoc that's been wreaking across the land, I decided to take this mere moment of peace that I had to regroup, gather my bearings together, and gear up for what would be the final fight with the Witherstorm. I think this is getting out of hand. Now there are three of them.
This is the deep self-reflection part of the video where I ponder if I really was the villain of the story for all the destruction I caused by summoning the Wither Storm. But this time is different. This time I can actually use the star's power. And just by holding it, it has opened up my eyes to something. Yes, yes, I am the villain of the story. This wasn't just for some silly challenge, some little game, just to see if I could defeat this boss. No, no. This star can do so much more.